behind your little feelings, it right. might not be absolutely nothing. Recorded it really feelings. bad or what? But behind right. every principle is a promise. And some of you in your life, the reason why you're not at your goal right now, because you just all about your feelings. I'm gonna go get fucking New York top. You, you all on your feelings. You don't feel like waking up. So who does? Every day you say no to your dreams, you might be pushing your dreams back a whole six months. This guy was um, a year. my support. That one That's single day, Leona. that one day like you didn't get up, could have pushed your stuff back. I don't know how long. Don't allow your emotions to control you. We are emotional, but you want to begin to discipline your emotions. If you don't discipline and contain your emotions, they will use you. You want it, and you're going to go all out to have it. It's not going to be easy when you want to change. It's not easy. If it were, in fact, easy, everybody would do it. But if you're serious, you'll go all out. I'm in control here. I'm not going to let this get me down. I'm not going to let this destroy me. I'm coming back. And I'll be stronger and better because of it. You have got to make a declaration. Whenever I'm this listening to this stuff, I'm not really for. listening to it. It's just like, it's like you're when people listen to music. Mind. You're not sitting you're there listening to the goddamn help. lyrics when you're playing League of Legends. You know? it's just, uh, it gets you into a certain mood, Except right? where you are and the responsibility like, that you're going to take yourself just letting you guys know. I'm not sitting here like you it's a mindset. It puts me in a mindset. As if it were my last. Puts me in a certain type of live mood. Your life with Positive type of mood. With some drive. Don't get angry. Decide that you're going to push yourself. The last chapter to your life has not been written yet. And it doesn't matter about what happened yesterday. It doesn't matter about what happens to you. What matters is what are you going to do about it? I won't talk about it anymore. I can't. I can't. I can't. She does, right? Yeah, she does. She could have killed me, man. I ate, too, I ate way too much damage there. I also wasn't drinking my pots like I was supposed to. Um. I had it on the wrong button. I thought I was drinking a pot and I wasn't. He's doing really well. There she is this such thing. She's just being a positive and a great person with the best of intentions towards everybody. He has a nice one. No defensive summon. But most of you, most of you are waking up every day. Looking for pain, dysfunction, drama, unemployment, being broke, struggling. Dropping every excuse in the book about your childhood and father and dysfunction that you grew up in that's stopping you from becoming successful. You don't like your friends, so why are you still there? You don't trust your managers, agents, and lawyers, so why are they still there? Do you really expect your life and career to be any different from messing with the same things and people in the situation? That's all I'm saying. Stop being a crazy, bum-ass person that's full of excuses, sitting around oh, no. on the pity potty, coming up with every excuse in the world as to why you got executed, so he um recalls you faster than you are not. You keep messing with negative, evil, and dysfunctional people and expecting positive results. It's time you get off the pity potty. Stop complaining about being out of shape when you never go to the gym. Stop looking at your stomach when you get out of the shower and your body and complaining about the way you look when you're eating everything in sight and never go to the gym. I don't care. You are the reason you She's gonna ignite me, huh? Look. Ignite me and let Amumu try to one v one me? You are the reason why your surroundings are so dysfunctional and negative. You could still be in the hood, broke and fucked up and living a peaceful life. It's a choice. We are being raised in a generation of people that come up with every excuse in the book as to why they are not winning. You have every excuse in the reason in the book why you're not spending time with your kids. Fathers, I'm talking to you. 
Why is he push up like that? You know what? Doesn't mean that you're a father. Got the kill. It doesn't mean that you understand the concept of father. It's time to stop coming up with excuses. Why five, six, seven months, and even years have went by without you seeing your child. It's wrong, and it's only the kids that are suffering in the end. Excuses sound best to the people that's making them up. You got every excuse in the world. I took LSD and meditated. That's why your shit ain't over. That's why ain't nothing changed and nothing will change. Because you have convinced yourself. Is that the same? Uh, that everything Lucian? is wrong. Everything is negative. Is negative, and nothing will change. And guess what? It won't change. Change your mind, and it will change your life. Change. If nothing around you changes, change the things that are around you. I'm frustrated. No level six. She's supposed to be close to because they have thought their way into a depression. You have thought your way into negativity and misery. You have thought your way. You want, you want some experience too? Holding on to a dude or a girl. That you I'm goodwill, man. A charity here. Sad, Come take the charity. I go give you the kill. <laughs> it's all give you experience. I give it to you all, man. I don't need it. I'm so good. I don't need. I don't need experience. I don't need a kill. You just have to. You just have to wake up. You just have to charity break soldier. that negative spirit. You have to break through all of that shit that you're carrying. I don't want to. I don't feel sorry for you. You feel sorry for yourself. That's the problem. Even when positive people are trying to give you all this good energy, you have tricked your mind to turn every positive thing that they say into something negative. Every time they say anything to try and motivate you and inspire you, you, you turn every negative thought and every you turn they every have, um, positive thought, a lot of AP. Every Triple AP. Intention, I know York's not really AP, but he's not really AP. Your spirits up, Amumu, Oriana, York. Shake it, manipulate it. I need, a, I need to build up. You, have, you are so determined MR. to be negative and miserable. It's unbelievable. Done with you. God is not done with you. This guy's crying so bad. But I actually have a problem with the fact that there are people out here that could be more than someone. Fault your way to the future. You have fault your way. This guy is crying so bad. His name is Tiverted Hermit. Hermit. Crying so bad. Everything about your life that you decided that you wanted for yourself is so negative, but yet you you're expected to produce positive results. I am so bad. It's not gonna happen, people. The outcome of your life and your career is based on the choices that you make. Moon was coming. I love it. I think that Oriana. Oh, I thought she was soloing up. No, no, no. For every level, there's another devil. For every level, there's another devil. Get off the pity side. It's your season. It's your moment. Right now. Question is, are you just gonna look at this video and decide <gasps> that was some power so shit bad. and do the same fucking thing? Cowardice. You got blue buff now? The question is, I think I'm fucked. I think I need to go home. Are you happy? And if you're not happy, 100% health. That's 100% What's mana. What's holding you back? What, what, what do you think that's the source of your life? What is it that oh. you think is going to change that will make things different for you? 
that you would be happy. That's the purpose of your life. We gotta look at what makes you really do what you do. You need to find something that's eternal inside of yourself. That no matter what changes on the surface, this part of you does not change. It's the part you come back to, the part that guides you, the part that really makes you feel. Most of us in life are so afraid something's gonna happen that we can't control, therefore we're gonna get pain. That we try to avoid those things we can't. We try to shape our lives, what do they where want? we spend our time, who we spend our time Where's with, she come from? what we do. By environments that we feel really comfortable in, where we feel like we're really in control of them. And what that does is it limits the shape and quality of our lives. You know, so many times we set goals or Who's we have dreams or we have plans Can't and we work our okay. tail off and it doesn't come out the way we want. And a lot of people come out of those situations disillusioned or angry or resentful or frustrated. Or they look for someone to blame. You know, sometimes I really truly believe Poor that not doing your goal is part of the design. Causing you to dig inside and discover more of yourself. To really begin to use your real capacities as human beings. Those traits that are within you that only expand when they're challenged. There's still people here. The How Moomoo do you live like in a here. world where Moomoo something, has something can happen and take away your too. whole business? Or, you know, a storm could come and take away your home. She's pushing now, so I don't have to, I don't have to be, I don't have to, like, um, a disease could do anything hit dangerous. Or she's pushing for me. How do you deal with all that? The answer is, you have to know the one thing you can control is behind the bench. You control is what they need. How much time do you really waste? For real. How much of our brains are we really going to use? So I don't care if you're a, you a star athlete. I don't care if you're a billionaire. I don't care if you're a CEO of one of the most important companies. I don't care if you're an entertainer. Like, I don't care who you are. We all have problems. Stop letting the problems you problems are part of life. There are two types of people in the world, okay, exactly who they are. You have people on one side who have reasons. They tell you all the fucking reasons why they can't become successful, why they can't get what they want in life. The question is, what are you going to do? Really good. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Let's go. I want you to focus on your dreams. Nobody ain't got to convince me of what I do. I want you to focus on your goals. I do what I do because I do what I do. I want you to focus on your solution because I'm built from something. And man, Mental masturbation, yeah. That's the best type of masturbation. I want you to focus on that dream life you have. If you put as much time into working on winning as you put into thinking about losing, you already be champion. This is what I believe. This is what you love. This is your passion. Step back. Don't judge it. If you judge it, judge not yet, unless you be judged. Why? Because when you judge it, you invest emotion in it, and that mo emotion could be anger. And guess what? That hurts you. That doesn't hurt anybody else. Earn the most you possibly can. Be the most you possibly can. I and here's that. why. The essence of life oh, yeah, is mad. growth. The essence of life is growth, to do the best you can. And here's what's interesting. Humans are the only life form that will do less than they possibly can. I'd rather lose out on my dream doing the right thing than the chief I care Flash. I want to know trying to make a shortcut to get to my goal. My best advice for you is to choose the all. Earn all you can, make all the friends you can, you me. read as many books as you can, develop as many skills as you can. I think he does have See as much as possible, do as much as possible, make as much fortune as possible, give as much of it away as possible. The max, there's no life like it. I'm telling you, once I got on track, I've never looked back. How much time do you spend working on you? How much time do you spend every day working on your dream? In the last 90 days, how many books have you read? In the last year, what 
You skill or knowledge have you acquired? What kind of investment have you made in you? So I'm saying that as you begin to look at where you want to go, if you want to make it today, and things are changing so fast, you have to literally run to stand still. I'm saying that you wow, got that's to make really a to begin she didn't get to develop up. you. Here's something else. Most people are not living their dreams because of fear, ladies and gentlemen. Fear, limited vision, and lack of self-esteem is what keeps most people doing things they don't want to do. How easy is it to get up in the morning when you know you're not doing all that it takes? It's not very easy at all. You can just lay there awake thinking, oh, what's a few more minutes in bed? It won't matter much anyway. Wrong. It does matter. It will matter. Now, how easy is it to get up in the morning when you're pouring it on, doing the best you can, anxious to get going, make progress toward your dreams? It's a whole different story. When you're resting to renew your reserves, it's much different than resting to avoid your day. When you're sucked up and excited for your life, when you're excited for what you plan to accomplish for the day, it's amazing you'll wake up before the alarm clock even tries to startle you away. Your successes fuel your ambition. Your successes give you extra energy. Your successes pave the way for more success. It's the snowball effect. With one success, you're excited to meet another, and another, and another. And pretty soon, the disciplines that were so difficult in the beginning, the disciplines that got you going, are now part of your philosophy. An enemy has been slain. How'd you know Sebi was here? Check the um check the viewer list or whatever. He's trying to lurk, man. Let him lurk. Uh, you get I thought Sebi was asleep. You get that gun. You get Stayed that up really late last night. To throw shit against the wall. Watching a persona streamer. What's for today, Sebi? we would like to go a lot of things we would like to experience and we just stop at but but will cause usually why people max anything is because but will it's stronger that's usually the answer you, you wanna you wanna ask like why is it stronger it's, it's probably because of numbers right. it's like if you you max E the base damage that you get from it is not a, it's not that good it's probably that's what it probably what it is tiptoeing to an early grade. We've been holding back. We have ideas that we don't act on, things we want to do, we're afraid to take chances. It's like if you max E, like it doesn't do anything for you. A lot of people say no to things and they don't even know what they're saying no to. Don't allow but to keep you in the corner. That's probably the reasoning. This isn't the old Morgan. Like, this isn't fucking who say, this isn't fucking 2013. More got reworked. Twice. E isn't and that good. E used to be the fucking better. E pushes faster, it probably doesn't push faster. 
You're probably okay. wrong about that. Even if I, that's the I that's the 2013 so more. I don't think that I don't think that's the new rework more. That does not make me a failure. Am I right, Sebi? Am I right, Sebi? Do you agree with me, Sebi? I think that's I think that's what it is. You're thinking of Mord as the old Mord. The old Mord is not the same. It's, it's different. It's a different. It's different. Do what you can, where you are, with what you have, and never be satisfied. Yeah, don't get satisfied Kill with back. yourself. Always <laughs> wherever you are, you can enjoy more, but you deserve more. See, now he's going to go feed on purpose so we can lose? Why don't you decide now that you're going to expand your world, that if other people can learn, you can learn too. See, if you're working on your dream, sure there'll be times you're going to want to give up. You got to live what's in you. Life is just too short and unpredictable. But what are, what are we saying? But, but there will always be tomorrow. Oh no. There's no guarantees you're going to show up tomorrow. Always something there. To build a case of why you can't move on, why you can't go to the next level, why you can't begin to manifest your greatness, why you can't begin to live life on your terms. Did that kill try to kill me a while ago? Yes, All she did was feed. She didn't do right anything. She got a moon wall out, I guess. Face, telling you to go back. So if you want to do something, if you thought about something you want to do, take it head on. Life will never be the same again. Live your dreams. Every five. Alright Echo, thanks man. See you later man. Many of us never realize our greatness because we become sidetracked by secondary activities. We spread ourselves too thin, don't know how to say no, and we find ourselves doing all kinds of things and never Top lane is such a shit lane, we win the game without, without, with our top lane beating and AFK. Who needs top lane?
top lane so bad. She AFK'd for like 10 minutes. Rage AFK'd and she fed. And we win really hard anyway. Top lane so bad. One idea can change your life. One idea can turn your life around. And as you convince you, yeah, Ilio is like really dumb. As you sell yourself, I think I think because the new Ilio or the Ilio I saw, she built some um, glass cannon. You assume a lot of times you see Ilio. Um, a lot of times you see that, you think like you think that they're um tank, but they don't they don't build tanks. They build like Ghost Blade and Sterax and stuff now. At least Sterax is getting nerfed. You got to do whatever is necessary until and when you give the best you can and that's not enough, you must do what is required. When you're hungry, you don't care about the facts. You don't care about the odds. When you step into your fears and continue to push yourself to go on, you begin to see things that's been standing there looking you in the face and I can't believe this has been here all this time. If it wasn't difficult, then there'd be no problem. There'd be no resistance. There'd be nothing to force you to push forward. And that's why I say the most important thing is the most important thing. That you don't that, that, that you don't overcome every barrier you can't climb. I don't want you to give up, but I want you to fail forward. Every mistake you make has to be another stepping stone, another building. Can't take Baron. And you've got to learn how to tune out the critics outside and the him. critic inside. And since I'm going the team to doesn't know how to do doesn't know how to work correctly. And I'm not gonna let anything stop. Thresh Thresh is warding for Dragon. When we already took Dragon. He's warded, he warded this, this. So he doesn't know how to set up a Baron. We have zero vision of Baron. We don't give up. We don't surrender. We don't quit. He's, he's, he's warding for Dragon when Dragon is gone. What the fuck? What the fuck? Setting up vision for an objective that's not there. What the fuck? Imagine you're on your deathbed, oh, and standing around your deathbed have no word. are the ghosts representing your unfulfilled potential. The ghost of the yeah, they don't, they don't want to do bad. They're too afraid to throw. The ghost of the talent you didn't win. Standing around your bed, angry, disappointed, and upset. They say we, we came to you because you could have brought us to life, they say. And now we have to go to the grave together. So I ask you today. How many ghosts are gonna be around here? Alright, man. But most people are living in 220 MR. For the fact that they don't believe they can have any more than what they now have. They accept the reality have flash. that they have been given. You have something special. You have talent and ability to use that you don't even know. Yes, you can. I want you to think about this goal that you want. I want you to envision it and see it in your mind's eye. That poor um, that poor chaotic genius, Sebi. Though he he was thinking about like what can he do to get better. Nobody wants to tell him. I don't want to tell him. There's a lot of it. I, I like I've, I've mentioned you that before. I was like, man, how did this guy ever reach masters? He's not even. He's nothing special. But I think he's just like a a nice guy, like a nice teammate. Like he, his laning isn't that great. I don't see anything special about him. 
except maybe um, that he plays. The only thing I can say good about him is um, he's a safe player. He doesn't feed. He kind of feeds, but he does. He he plays really passive. He's like an AFK player. Don't fail. He seems like a, like an AFK. He like no impact. Like he's like um. It reminds me of that still bad guy. 